Enjoy 1% merchant commission when you accept Lanka Pay cards. Contact these banks today. SLP PMP Sanat Nishant, Milan Jayatilaka and Dan Priyasad surrendered their mobile devices to the CID on Wednesday. The trio is named as suspects in the case filed over the attack on the Gota Gogama protest site on the 9th of June 2022. Fort Magistrate Tilinagamage ordered the suspects to be detained in court until they surrender the mobile devices to the CID. The court made the relevant order as the trio failed to comply with the previous court order to surrender their mobile devices to the CID. Fort Magistrate Tilinagamage noted that if the three suspects fail to comply with the order, their bail will be terminated and they would be returned to remand custody. President's Council Upuljaya Surya appearing for the aggrieved party told the Fort Magistrate's Court on Wednesday that SLPP parliamentarian Sanat Nishanta at a media briefing had made comments in a manner that affects the judiciary. The President's Council alleged that the comments affect the lawyers and officers from the Attorney General's Department who attend to judicial matters. Accordingly, Fort Magistrate Tilnagamage ordered the CID to obtain the original video of the press conference where the MP made the comments from the respective media institution and conduct an investigation. The council appearing for the aggrieved party in the matter questioned the reason as to why the authorities have failed to arrest senior DIG Deshabandhu Tenukun, who is also a suspect in the case, and produce him in court. The CID officers informed the court that the Attorney General had advised them that he would issue the necessary instructions on senior DIG Deshabandhu Tenakun at the conclusion of the investigations. The matter will be called up again on the 5th of October.